Eat it. Eat it. So eat it. Hey, welcome. This week we are learning all about the word eat. I was practicing learning about the word eat, listening to the song Eat It by Weird Al Yankovic. It is a fun song to practice the word eat. <clears throat> now, my ice cream cone has three words. One is I eat it. Now at home, you can make this um, with your communication partner. You need four colors of construction paper and you can make a triangle and cut it out and you've got a cone and then three circles and that makes the scoops. And you could draw pictures for I and eat and it. Do that. Today, I'm gonna show you where we find the word eat. On our core board, eat is right here. Eat. On the pod book, to get to eat, you need to go to more to say and turn to page two. <clears throat> And then it's going to be here under I want, and that'll take us to page 11. <clears throat> I want something to eat or drink. And then we can go to page 18. Now, touch chat with word power. That word is right here. Eat. Eat. Now, if I am using snap plus core first, Here's how I'm going to find it. I am going to go to actions. Do you see it? It's right up here. Eat. That is how you find the word eat on a variety of, on a variety of high and low tech communication devices. Now we are going to read our book about the word eat. Look at this, it looks like there are two friends and they are eating ice cream, just like I was earlier. I'm going to use touch chat with word power today when I am reading. So when you hear the word eat, you're gonna look, look, look on your AAC device. Eat. And you're gonna find the word eat. If you can't touch the word eat, your communication, or you don't know that word yet, you, your communication partner can touch it for you. All right, here we go. Hmm, wonder what they're gonna be eating. Eat. See if you can find it. You found it. <clears throat> All right, looks like we start with a question. Here's the ice cream truck. I see it. Ice cream truck is the book says, do you want to eat? Hmm. I heard it. Let me see if I can find it. Let's say, I want to eat. eat. I want to eat. Ah, oh, now here's the little girl coming up to the ice cream truck. She says, I I do. I want to eat. I heard it, did you? Here's the other friend and she says, I do. I want to eat. Oh, she got an ice cream sundae. That looks yummy. We have a third friend. It looks like she's got a fudge sickle. That looks yummy. I like it. She says, I do. I want to eat. I like fudge sickles. I think I would like to eat, eat. a fudge sickle this afternoon. We have a fourth friend. She says, I do. I want to eat. 
she's got an ice cream cone, a soft serve one. Those are really good. Did you find eat? Oh, you did. You're getting so good at this. <gasps> they all have their treats and they say, thank you. The end. Today, we have a special guest. Her name is Paisley. She is one of Hermie's friends and she is going to show us all about eating. I hope you enjoy it. She's a really fun dog. What's for, what's for breakfast, Paisley? Did she drop a piece? Basic. Basic. What are you doing? Are you having some watermelon? Is that kind of stuff? sure likes to eat watermelon. Um, now I think it's time to sing our song and I think Paisley was singing this song in her mind the whole time she was eating that watermelon. Do you want to eat? I do. Do you want to eat? I do. Do you want to eat? I do. I like to eat. Today for our activity, there's a couple different things you can do. You can make the ice cream cone that we showed earlier in the video, which sounds kind of fun. Or you could get some type of cereal with holes in the middle. So I'm using Honest O's, um, but you could use anything with holes in the middle um, to make a necklace so that you can wear it and then you can eat the cereal right off the necklace. You'll need a ribbon or some string or yarn and then you'll need to make sure that you tie a good knot. You have your helper tie a good knot on the bottom and then you are going to take an O and you're going to put it through and pull it onto your ribbon. So you're stringing that O on to the ribbon. I'm gonna do another one just so you can see it. I'm gonna hold it in one hand. See, there's the hole. And I'm gonna poke the ribbon in the hole. And then I grab the end of the ribbon with my other finger. And then pretty soon I have a really awesome necklace. You can ask your adult helper to tie it in the back and then you can practice the word eat every time someone finds the word on their AAC device or you find it on your AAC device you can say eat and then guess what mm. you can eat a piece of cereal mm. those honest O's are honestly really good now we are going to practice learning to read and write the word eat here's our power word eat. Here are also some ways that you can practice the word eat using lots of words on your core board. Let's start writing and reading. Got my marker, got my choppers out. Chop, 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 grab. I'm going to pull the top off. I'm going to put it right here just to remind me that I need to Hold those fingers down and I'm going to rest my marker back here. 
We're gonna start with capital letters first. E starts at the top. It has a big line down and a line, little line at the top, a little line at the middle, and a little line at the bottom. It can say E, just like its name, or E. Okay, the next letter in the word eat is an A. <clears throat> an A is slide down. You're gonna hop back up, slide down, and go across. An A, like E, can also say its name or A, ah, but in this word, E makes A be quiet. So it's gonna be kind of silly. All right, then T, <clears throat> another letter that starts up at the top and across, and it says T. Can you say T in your head? There we go. So A is gonna make E say its name. It's gonna say eat, eat. Can you say that? Eat, eat. Say it in your head, eat. Can you say it in a whisper voice? Eat. What about a loud voice? Eat. What other crazy voices can you come up with to practice reading and the word eat? Eat. Next, we're going to do lowercase letters. So lowercase e lives down here below the line and you start like you're throwing the baseball and then you go up and around and run the bases. And we have that letter e, which in eat says its name e. And then we've got our A, it's like a magic C. It goes up and then it comes down and bumps the bottom line. A can say A or A, ah, but in this word, it's gonna make the E say its name E. And then we've got our T, just like the capital T, a big line down, but this time you cross in the middle. T, E, T. Can you say that? E, T. Say it in your head, eat. All right, I want you to come up with two other ways that you can say eat in some sort of crazy voice in your head. Now that you know where to find the word eat in your AAC device and how to read it and write it and some activities to um, work on learning the word eat and you've got a great eat song. I have got to run because Hermie is always hungry and he is ready to eat. Until next time.